our today's topic is relative error and accuracy. So, now how to find our possible error and how to find our relative error. Now, to find our possible error, to find our relative error. So, normal error, our normal error is 1 over 2, so which is 0.5. Now, we have 0.5. Now, to find our possible error, so you will use the value, how many number after the point. So, we have what? We have one number here. So, this is our normal error. 0.5 now you will use we have what how many number here we have one so you will add one zero here so for the second one we have what normal error is 0.5 0. Point. we have how many number after point we have one 0. 0.05 so for the third one we have how many number after point we have one point which is 0. 0.05 so our last one, we really have number after the point. So we have what? We have so for the 98, 98 seconds. So we didn't have any number after the point. So this one now equal to our normal error, which is 0.5. So that is how to find our possible error. Now to find our relative error. So our relative error, our relative error now equal to possible possible error divided by measurement measurement so possible error divided by measurement so what is our measurement this is our measurement so this are what possible error now for this for the first one now you call to 0. 0. 0. 0.05 divided by our measurement is 3.2 so this one now you call to 0 0.02 so for the second one now equal to 0 0.0005 so for the third one now equal to 0 0.007 while the fourth one now equal to 0 0.005 so that is how to find our relative error and possible error thank you for subscribing